As the first day of the project draws to an end, things are beginning to take shape. There's a slide, there's a ladder, and there's... well, that's just a trash can. But in less than 24 hours, this construction zone outside the Southwest Family YMCA will become a brand new playground. We've had playgrounds here before, nothing this extensive or this nice. And it's not just the size or quality that makes this playground special. This playground is one of more than 60 around the nation that have been built thanks to Carter's Kids, a charity that helps fund these playgrounds, meaning all the equipment and help are donated. Yeah, all volunteer manpower. 20 years down the line, our kids can come and play, and we can I can bring my kids and be like, we build this together. Southwest Family YMCA Executive Director Ronnie McKiernan says this location was chosen because of its accessibility to the community, with the hopes the playground will be busy with children. But these playgrounds hope to promote more than just a good time. It's to help stop child obesity, to like get children off of their video games. We thought a great way to do that is to actually not talk about it, but build them some playgrounds so they can actually have something to play on. Uh, help their core development, their social development. Just getting them out there and making sure, you know, they're, they're getting some exercise in, they're being active. It's this reason why volunteers like 11-year-old Kaysen Williams are out, hoping to make a difference. And in Kaysen's case, hoping to tell his friends who will use this playground, he had a hand in making it. They would be like, that's not true. <laughs> and I'd be like, it is. It's one afternoon of their time they're giving back to their community. It's just nice to know that you had a little bit to do with that. Hoping the few hours Sunday make lifetimes of change.